What is going on everyone? Welcome to another brand new YouTube video of Horizon Zero Dawn PS5 Gameplay walkthrough 1440p FPS Episode 14 Deep Secrets of Earth Let's get started with today's video If you guys find this video really incredible, please like the video, subscribe, comment, and also share the video on social media Let's get started with the video today Yes, I'm playing this on the PS5. I just want to—I want to let you guys know that one of my goals on YouTube get monetized. If you don't believe in my—if you don't believe in my dreams, why are you sub? I don't. If you don't believe in my dreams. Just saying. Just saying. Just saying the truth was was not true. Come on. I'm gonna knock his ass out. I'm gonna knock his ass out, bro. This ain't right. Yeah, I'm gonna stay up. Can't kill me. Can't kill me. Get that. Oh shit. No, 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 no. I think that's it. Yeah, hold on, guys. Hold on. How's everything attacking me? Oh, shit. What the hell? Who's there? I'm almost there. Shit, I might be dead. Yeah, that's it. Guys, I gotta I gotta get the health. Oh, something's not good over here. What's that? This one. Look at all these invisible ones. I can still see my mess. Stop trying to be camouflaged. You dead. You're dead. And I'm already like level 27 already. What the hell? Hold on, hold on, hold on. How did she spawn like that? Wait, how did that hit me? Hey, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. I see you in the background. A shot at him. This dude is packing that heat right here. Got him. You dead. You dead. I'm like level 27 already, guys. I'm so sorry about this. I started off that way. Um, the reason I started off that way is because, well, they wanted to attack me first. I'm already like level 27. What the hell? What's up with the... That was easy, bro. Oh, no. Stop attacking me. Dead. All right, so I gotta go fifteen thousand. I gotta go one thousand five hundred miles from there. So, what I'm gonna do, guys, is I'm gonna go that far, and I will uh catch you guys when I get there. You guys, when I get there, be right, be right back. All right, guys, I finally made it. My destiny, supposed to be. Um, 
took a took a lot of time to get there. Kind of countered a few dinosaurs right here. Pretty much, it weren't problem. Uh, pretty much. That's how we're almost like level twenty. Go guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and go up these stairs. Welcome to the Citadel, Eloy. I'll check back with you in a moment. Outlander. In the meantime, if you want to hear about today's bounties, head for the throne room. You're not going to make any shards by standing out here. I hear the shadow crunch are looking for one of their own. Should pay well. By the glory of the sun revealed. Behold, radiant Edaman, the one true sun king, the light in shadow, whose will is light and lifetime trying to uncover the secrets of this world. Where the machines came from, how the old ones achieved such marvels only to fall into silence and death. A lifetime of failure, as year by year, decade after decade. I hit walls I could not break, doors I could never breach. Hello. Until a Nora Huntress marched out of the savage east. And, voila, for her, all the deepest secrets of the earth were laid bare. I suspect you will have an easier time with this door than I did years ago. Hold for identiscan. Genetic profile confirmed. Entry authorized. Malfunction. 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 Are you kidding me? You don't hear me laughing. Shut up. There's gotta be another way. Hey! Elizabeth Sobek here! Requesting access! Access request acknowledged. Root command functions available. Do you wish to proceed? I do! Get me through this door! Analyzing. Primary access inoperable due to mechanical failure. Emergency venting procedure likely to circumvent blockage. Do you wish to proceed? Yes. Emergency venting authorized. I understand. Too bad now. everything that will draw attention we won't have this place to ourselves for long now we last i checked i was the one risking my life down here yes fine now will you please get moving there's so much to learn in less time than i'd hoped oh that's crazy all right anyways guys i'm gonna do something cool here hold on one second guys all right guys i'm Basically back from what I, what I was doing. Project Zero Dawn. Zero Dawn. We found it. Are you really so surprised? Facility, now please take a seat and wait for your name to be called. A selection of beverages and snacks are of Please proceed into viewing room one for an important message. What? What was this place? A holographic theater. CD01 data intact. Initiating playback. Welcome to Project Zero Dawn. I am General Harris, Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff of the United States of America. I'm sure you've heard the rumors that Zero Dawn is a top secret super weapons program, the technological miracle that will save us from the Pharaoh Plague if Operation Enduring Victory can hold off the robots long enough. The reason I'm sure you've heard the rumors is that I'm the one who spread them, and they are all lies. Zero Dawn is not a super weapons program, and it will not save us. Nothing will save us. 
only his why. By the time the glitch was noticed, it was already too late. Nothing could stop the Pharaoh Plague. Nothing can. Its robots will continue to replicate and devour the biosphere. Life on Earth. That shit is crazy right there. Uh, that shit is actually crazy. Barren sphere. You know, these we're robots. Global extinction is inevitable. No matter how many we kill, the robots just keep exponentially making more. If we had their deactivation codes, we could shut them all down. It, it is the actually crazy. But since their cryptographic protocols use polyphasic entangled waveforms, cracking a code set would take half a century. At best, we've got 16 months. Not exactly what you'd call a survival option. The destruction of a biosphere is not the sort of apocalypse you can wait out in a fallout shelter or a space station. There will be no Earth left to reclaim. Just a lifeless, toxic rock with several million pharaoh robots on it, hibernating, waiting for something to eat. True. The pharaoh plague is devouring the biosphere. Life yep, that's itself crazy. will cease to exist. But does that have to be the end? What if we could give life a future? What if we could build a kind of seed from which, on a dead planet, life could blossom anew? This is the aim, the hope, of Project Zero Dawn. To create a super intelligent, fully automated terraforming system and bring life back from lifelessness. What would such a system require? At its core, it would need a true AI, fully capable of making the trillions of decisions necessary to reconstitute the biosphere. An immortal guardian, devoted to the reflourishing of life. We call it Gaia. Mother Nature as an AI. Gaia? That sounds that's strange. The core of the I don't know, guys. She will need to be surrounded that sounds a little spooky. and empowered by a comprehensive suite of yeah, it subordinate does. functions. Think of them as extensions of Gaia's mind, each dedicated to a specific purpose. Now, these aren't AIs, but make no mistake, each presents an engineering challenge more profound than anything the human species has ever before attempted. Hardware that preserves and then gestates the billions of seeds and embryos from which life will be reborn. The construction of underground facilities to hold it all. And that's just the start. We don't have to build the entire system. Guy doesn't sound good. I, I don't trust that. The system is that it can build itself. Now, over the days to come, you'll learn how all these functions, all these pieces that you'll be working on, fit together. How we'll race the clock to execute our harvest initiatives, write the software, build the tech and the facilities. How we'll lock it down and seal it up before the inevitable occurs but even more important you'll know how it doesn't end here how gaia will generate those deactivation codes general harris talked about and build the transmission arrays to broadcast them shutting down the feral robots for good how gaia will not just build but imagine any conceivable robot it needs to do its work across centuries from detoxifying the earth's ravaged atmosphere and poisoned seas to the regreening of the earth from cryopreserved seed stocks, to rewilding the earth with animal life, and then, when all that is done, how a new generation of human beings spawned at cradle facilities around the globe will partake of Apollo, the vast archive of human knowledge and cultural achievement from which they will learn of us, our world, and most important, how not In to repeat our mistakes. It's not an impossible dream. It is within our grasp if we work tirelessly and stop at nothing to achieve it. We can't stop life from ending. But if you will help me, help Gaia, we can give it a future. Join me and help Gaia, make huh? that future real. I don't sound right. I don't trust that. I don't trust that one little bit. I'm stupid to be true. I'm leaving this gun in this room. Okay, something happened. Buy a machine. I'm 
machine of creation. Elizabeth did this. It's life. Yes. Why Hades? Intruder! Them? Get her! If it was part of Whatever you do, don't die. <laughs> Anywhere ever again near me. We're stupid idiots. First place. Oh, with me. This mission is gonna be a little tough. Enemies will drop it eventually. Okay, we're going. I'll tuck that away. To go up there. Oh, we gotta go up here. Okay, something about this room, I don't know if, like, they want us Can't do with this. On about. That was... Can't carry more. What did you get up there? All right, I'm just trying to figure this out. So we're right there. I can't get up there. How, how would you get up there? Go about getting up there. Oh. 
Oh. Hold on, guys. I had to go upstairs. Hold on. Let me check some. Guessing they want us. Kind of backwards. Up. Good. Down, down, up, down. Or am I reading that wrong? Okay. The first one is up. I'll be reading it. Goes that way. That one is down. This way. Doesn't work. Doesn't work. So. That one is up. That one. All right. Down. This one. That one. Not working. So, he's trying to get out of me. Must want me to what? what? I am getting this puzzle wrong. Okay, down and this way. Not working. Get that shit. Oh. Not working. Up, up. All right. Not working. No guns. Get ready for. 
for the ship. Room's clear. For a moment, anyway. Let's get moving. You have to find Gaia. I'm on level 28 already. That's crazy. That's crazy. Hello, I'm Margo Shen, and this is Hephaestus. As the name might tip you off, this is going to be the subordinate function that Gaia will use to make lots and lots of robots. Her personal forge. Except. Oh. Welcome to Apollo, the collective memory of the human species and the wellspring of knowledge for future generations. So there's a lot of people in this room, Bunch. though. Until recently, I was director of the International Collective Memory Institute in Utera. As a hip. Wait, what was that? Did you see me? See who's it in here. I will be almost seventy years old. I'm not lying. I'm joking. I'm not joking. You guys. logic won't cut it, Ted. To pull this off, guy is going to need to have some. Your twenty sixty six happens. Maybe Infinite will be, yes, almost 70 years old. Back. Not like it's a child. What if it becomes a monster? We looking for her office. This is so. This game is based in guys. The funny thing about the future, maybe Infinite will be literally still have it. The Alpha yes. Registry Master File. Intact? Yeah. No signs of corruption. Then what are you waiting for? Copy the file. This, I can restore the registry at the hatch inside All Mother. Open it. Go inside. And grasp the secrets within. Where I was born. Maybe. Maybe who gave birth to me. Who? Are you really so naive? There will be no who waiting for you there, Aloy. Whatever birthed you into the world was a what, not a who. You bastard. Oh no, I had a legitimate birth. 
It's you, Aloy, who are the creation of a machine. But what kind of machine and why? Why were you created? Oh, shit. Eclipse. You need to get out of there. What you found is too valuable. You're too valuable. Oh shit. And yet, your words touch close to the truth. In my heart, I deem the order to kill you unworthy of me. You were just a savage girl. So I thought at the time. Even still, I aimed to kill you. And yet did not. This failing troubled my thoughts haunted every step it was only when i captured you down in that place that i finally glimpsed the sun's design etched at length across the course of events you were meant to survive that day on the mountain meant to interfere at dig sites and kill my men conversely I was meant to capture you here so that you might die as a sacrificial offering to the sun. Everything as it was meant to be, predestined and preordained. doesn't he? You're being played for a fool. Hades is an ancient machine, not the buried shadow of Karja myth. It doesn't care about Meridian. It wants to kill everything and everyone. And you are its dutiful slave. I serve not the buried shadow, but the sun in shadow. All halves of nature joined to one cause. Shadow to sun, dark to light do you really not hear how ridiculous that sounds you've gone from serving an insane homicidal sun king to an insane homicidal machine you're moving down in the world not up i'll remember those words as i watch your corpse burn whatever's left of it you fail to grasp the point as surely as you've been conquered so has all doubt and with certainty of belief comes unstoppable force. Then come this cage and put your faith to the test. See if things work out like you expect. The circle has closed. Every element is in its proper place, exactly where it belongs. The errant beast, now caged, will serve her true purpose. A sacrificial animal. Oh. Speaking of sacrifice, I forgot to tell you. After you crashed the Eclipse Network, I sent messengers into the East to rally the forces there and mount an invasion of the sacred land. I ordered every Nora killed. I was hoping to catch you there, but alas, it all seems to have been unnecessary. Why butcher dozens of innocents for no gain? It's a waste of effort. You're right. I won't even be there to enjoy it. In any case, I couldn't recall the order even if I wished to. Thanks to your destruction of the network, communication over distances is impossible. You not only doomed yourself, but an entire tribe. Do we not see the scorching judgment of the sun in these events? 
Your focus. Such a powerful device, isn't it? And yet, so fragile. So you see, this time, I did not hesitate. The knife has already been twisted. Are faithful. Rejoice! Our years in shadow are over. A new dawn trembles on the horizon. A new day soon to break. And when it does, the false Sun King will be dead, and Holy Meridian ours once more. In this, I have become an instrument of prophecy. All halves of nature join to one cause. Shadow to sun, light to dark, night to day. Behold! Hold your seats! Can you not see the proof of the sun's blessing before your eyes? How else? Proud in broad light of day. Were they not approved by the sun and joined to our cause? Many years ago, to consecrate this great ring, the Radiant Turan ordered many faithless, crushed beneath the hooves of the behemoth. Mighty is the behemoth in the eye of the sun, but it is mightier still in fuse the power of shadow. Let this one, who schemed and slithered, be the first to die! Let her be the first of thousands! I'm going to go ahead and do this one in the next part. Right? Ready, everyone? Uh, uh, That's where I'm going to end it at for now, guys. Uh, I want to thank you guys very much for watching. If you found this video really incredible, please make sure you guys do me a favor. And uh, again, please watch the end of the video because there are some playlists that I think you guys should check out. If you think this series is incredible, please go and watch my playlist of... um. But the uh, recent videos of Horizon Zero Dawn, if you want to watch first episode through, uh, you want to watch part one through, um, 14, let me know. You guys can catch it there, but thank you guys very much for watching. Anyways, guys, remember that the future is also infinite forever. Thank you for watching. Peace. We can make a wild, wild day.